Okay, teach me how to say the proper, uh, how to say the show's name properly, because I always do it wrong. Ingobernable. Ingobernable. <laughs> Close. <laughs> um, this is such a fun role for you to talk about why you, what attracted to you to the part and, you know, how you initially came on board. Well, everything's attractive. You know, playing the first lady uh, of Mexico for the first time is also attractive. Uh, I love uh, playing this roles as like empower, empowering women and, and this lady that she's, you know, everything goes wrong in the first episode. So she starts running and proving herself every single day as we, as women do all the time, proving ourselves to the world so um so that's what she does and 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 she's a strong woman and she's fighting to for her ideas and and for mexico you know they promised something and she now she has to to do it to make it happen um she is a very strong woman and we are very curious about her journey um who are some strong women in your life that you help base this character on Oh, I, I, my my mother. My mom is the strongest woman I've ever known, and 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 she taught my sister and and I uh, how things are in life, you know, and how you have to see in within. Because we, she says always that we are warriors. We all are. We just need to put it out. <laughs> uh, the show is so relevant t today with you know with everything that's going on in the in politics in the world. Talk about the show's. Um, why is it important for a show like this to be on TV right now? Well, I think it's, as you said, it's just the right timing. Netflix does that. You know, they know exactly what's going on, and, and they just put it out there with amazing shows. And I think this is a very interesting show, uh, not only for Mexicans and Latin Americans, but for Americans too, and, and the entire world, because it's, a, it's something that happens um, in every single government. You know, they're all, you know, we know, they're yeah, all know. corrupted. Yeah. There's always going, things going on. But right now, the timing is just... It's just great, you know. Um, it's not based on the on the real first lady at all. It's fiction, but still, there's some things that have that they're going on in Mexico that we relate to in the show, which is interesting. And it's interesting also for Americans to, to see this big difference between the wealthy, powerful Mexico and exactly the opposite. You know, going all the way to the lowest. Um, the show is obviously you know, Spanish speaking. Were you a bit nervous about doing a show for the broader market that's all Spanish speaking? No, I think it's the right time. You know, it's time for you Americans to start reading subtitles. <laughs> <laughs> we we grew up with that, you know, right, watching yeah. your movies. So uh, for me, it's just normal. I and I watch every single show. I, and if I need to read, you know, Portuguese or French or they're amazing shows now, and, and it's just the content. And I think this content is appealing to every audience there. This is a very attractive cast. Did you have a hand in picking yes. who was casted? Because I was of like, course. Whoa. of course. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So, uh, no, not at all. I, I do have my saying, of course, because right. I'm also producing. But, um, uh, you know, they're amazing. First of all, they're amazing, amazing actors. They're more uh, theater and more, uh, you know, on stage. No, everyone has their chops. Actors. Oh, yeah. They're, they're amazing. I had a great time. Amazing. Congratulations. Thank you so much.